sup? Though, keep it cool, keep it classy. Subscribe to Sup Those Bros channel. Sup, though. What's up, Internet? Welcome to Handle It Online Instructional Cooking Show. I'm Harley, and today we are cooking aboard a Navy boat. Okay. It's a ship. We're aboard the USS Stout DDG 55 guided missile destroyer. Wow. That would please tell the difference between a ship and a boat. Boats ride on ships. <laughs> Don't forget that it's the first minute of Handle It, and we are already learning things. Obviously, today we have some special guest cooks. Guys? Hey, I'm Jocko Sims. The contrary to what your eyes are telling you, I'm not sure. I play Lieutenant Burke on the last ship. Check it out every Sunday at 9 p.m. on TNT. I'm Adam Baldwin. I play XO Slattery aboard the last ship. So today we're making okay. a macaroni and beer, cheese, bacon, hot dog, Holy casserole. Shit. Let's get to it, boys. We got a lot of cooking to do. Bacon. More bacon. Gotta have that. Okay, bacon. so first things first, you take a big slab of bacon here. Bacon. And then we're gonna <laughs> cut it up. I love bacon. Very important to have a sharp oh, me knife. Too. Carefully, you don't cut your fingers off because we don't add any blood to this recipe. I wish I had a bacon bed. I could just wake up and start eating my pillow. Oh, <laughs> that sounds genius. Yeah. We made that on Epic Mealtime once. No, you didn't. Yeah, <laughs> no, you didn't. TNT didn't give us your number at that moment in time. Must have been season one. Real life culinary specialist, by the way. Hey, how are you? Here right now. How's it going? Thank you for letting us mess with oh, your reality. Once the bacon is cooked, what do we do? Make some macaroni and cheese. If you don't know how to make I macaroni, love and, macaroni cheese, and cheese, you stop watching this video. You're not ready for cooking. You should just eat popsicles. <laughs> basically, it's boil water, boil the noodles, drain the water, add cheese. Jocko, you made this mac and cheese? Absolutely. Okay. I love I macaroni and cheese, bro. Man. Yes, indeed. I ran out of popsicles. I had to learn how to do something else. Oh, <laughs> the end of our career. You hear that? What? Not the sound of bacon sizzling. What? It's the birth of your digital career. I mean, oh. No service down here. <laughs> this is a real boat. Ship. God. <laughs> so what are you going to do is you're going to take your hot dogs, you're going to pan fry them or grill them however you want to do it until they're brown. Then you'll flip them in a second. That's nice. Yeah. <sighs> this this shit makes me hungry every time yeah, we watch it. It's not even a real country. Yeah. <laughs> okay, next step. Beer cheese sauce. Throw in your butter. You got your minced garlic. Oh, yeah. Throw that in there. Because we're going to be making a roux. How do you spell roux? R O U X, Canadian. It's really this much of it. Here, I found some flour. Add flour and seasoning. Make it. Don't let it burn. The key to a great roux is you got to keep stirring. You don't want to let it burn. Right. That's my southern roots coming out. Now, since we're aboard a Navy guided missile destroyer, let us just say. Due to regulations, this is a non-alcoholic beer. You can use whatever beer at home you prefer, be it a stout, a pale ale, or an IPA. We gotta try to make some, some of this shit, man. Some sort of a cream, cream, nice big, nice big jug of milk some there, Baldwin. Thank you. Give it a Thank chance you. to cook down, let it simmer, and uh, get a better consistency. Get a little more consistency on your shell as well. Oh, so how long <laughs> can you cook Just this stuff down until we can add the cheese? Listen, we're chilling, man. Jocko, how do you like your women? Like I like my root, nice and thick. Oh. I like my women like I like my cheddar, aged and sharp. Okay, he you likes most. Me too. Too much. Gets a little stinky otherwise. In it goes. Don't splatter. I I don't want it. I'm gonna fire my agent. I think the meat is burning on the grill behind that. Oh, oh that's bacon. Bacon. I could just... Now what you want to do is you want to chop the hot dogs, also known as Lorena Bobby. If okay. you're born sometime in the 90s, you don't know who that is. Don't worry about it. Yeah, I, I don't. <laughs> All right, now I've heard of those. Well, no, I think I do. Now we're going to take half of the bacon off of the grill or out of your pan. That's about half there. You're going to take all the hot dogs. There's better tools to use this than just a little spatula. My stomach hurts. Dump in all the back. And of course, the cheese sauce is going to go in here. Oh, oh, macaroni and cheese. Uh, yeah, let's take half. Ladies and gentlemen, this is no. Pour important. everything in there. Stop right here and start eating. But we're not going to do that. Maybe if it was me solo, I would stop and do it. But I got Chaco and I got Adam here. I'm not stopping. We're going to take it to the next level. Waterfall of cheese. Harley. Yeah. Oh, stuff's great. Oh, yeah. I love them. More cheese. Would be at all concerned and bacon. Things like diabetes, heart disease. Uh, uh, absolutely. You, you guys should be. Concerned. The key word is moderation. You want to have small portions. Portion control. Portion control. Or Fuck that. balleration, which is you just put more than you even need. Balleration, I just came up with that. Copyright trademark. <laughs> you want a t-shirt? Sure, 30 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, why are they using the rest of that baby? Guys, I know you're watching and I know what you're thinking. 
what are we going to do with the other half of that bacon? A little bacon. We're going to put it on top and sprinkle just like this. Very oh, important thing, a little bacon as you sprinkle it. Yes. Sprinkle it What's yes. the difference between Canadian bacon and American bacon? American bacon's real. Now take the oh, and put it in the oven, which is preheated at 400 degrees Fahrenheit until the cheese is melted. Basically, that takes how long, Harley? Uh, like 15 minutes. 15 minutes. Okay, so we have our handy dandy timer here. We're going to set it for 15 minutes. Did you bring that from home? No, I can't. <laughs> United States guided missile destroyer. Uh, Canadian guided missile destroyer do not come hey, with she's... kitchen timers. You're right, nor do they come with guided missiles. Good coffee. You remember when he was like, uh, the president was like, is this glass bulletproof? And you're like, no, Mr. President, it's not. Yeah, I don't think it should be I, I, I particularly like the part where I administered the coup de Gracie to the alien. Uh, too. That's French. You really sold out since then. <laughs> Baby needs new shoes, brother. Brother needs new shoes, baby. <laughs> Jocko, Adam, you guys are cooks now, man. Wow. Shit. Thanks, uh, thanks to you guys. Oh Thank you my so god. Here it is, Internet. We made it right here. The mac and beer cheese, hot dog bacon casserole on this Navy boat. Kidding. Ship. I know. This is a bad joke. And we did it with our special guest cooks, Adam Baldwin. Jocko soon. Thank you so much, guys, for making this possible. And now there's only one thing left for us to do, and that is eat these bad boys. Let's <laughs> Oh, it looks so cheesy. And bacony. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. We gotta make macaroni cheese with bacon strips in it. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed this episode of Handle It. Big thanks to The Last Ship, which airs on TNT Sundays at 9 p.m. Make sure you check it out. And I'd like to give an even bigger thanks to the U.S. Navy for allowing us to film on one of their ships. Huge shout out to all the men and women out there that serve their country. Every time we watch uh, Epic Meal Time, it makes me so hungry, you guys. Like, these are creations I've never seen before. Like, it almost, like. Are you guys hungry right now? Oh, uh, if you're not, then. You're crazy. Uh, yes. Do you guys like macaroni and cheese as much as I like macaroni and cheese? Because every time we watch And I videos, dare you to say you like it more than I do. Man, yo. Okay, maybe you do. You never know. But shit. You I don't know about the hot dog part, but I would definitely make a macaroni and cheese with bacon, like cut up, chopped up bacon in it. You alright, man? You drooling how a you, little bit. You drooling. How you feel about macaroni and cheese is how I feel about bacon. Like, but I love bacon too. Yeah, but which one you like more? There is no, I can't do that. Yeah. That's why I want to put them both together. Exactly. <laughs> so, look, you can. I've said this before. You can go into watching this video starving, or you can go watching this video after directly eating something. Chances are you're going to be hungry either way. All right. Yeah. Or so, eat something while you're watching this, so you can just be like, hmm, I think I'll make that next time. Which we should definitely start doing, watching these videos. That's going to be in the near future, though. Be on the lookout for that. But keep it cool. Keep it classy. And we love you. Stay awesome. Always and forever.